Ross. Second game of a Saturday doubleheader. You see head coach Glenn Moore there getting his team ready. OU. She wasn't able to pitch the game she would normally pitch because she wasn't getting certain calls. Uh, so tonight. Launch to the left field, but Strain puts it away. The two of them kind of trading places back and forth. Run. In the first outing of the day. Drives that one to left field. Won't be long now. Home run. Exactly what T.R. Jennings was looking for. Well, breaking that barrier earlier in the game, Turned early the inside in the pitch, game. and got all of it. Good thing you moved your parking spot. <laughs> Bait. I'm all the way over to the <laughs> left. I'm behind the baseball stadium. Lee slaps it into right field. Trying to make a play at first is hot. Safe. Definitely Leaving the game. Ball four. Sanders on base again, this time with a wall. Right to strain in left field. The quick out the Baylor Bears needed. Hit straight into center field. Wilson goes back to the wall. A snow cone on a Saturday. Popped up. Lions is there. It's a big time high school. The Jenners went there. Take it for Sunday, knowing they were attending those things. That can't do it now. Tobin, first hit of the afternoon for her and for Baylor. It was Govan's homer in. Hits that one. Right at Sanders. Slaps that one, but it is right at Jennings who gets it over to Sanders, inning over. Else pretty much the same except for Casey West is at third base now. He was a walk on his okay. freshman year. Um, I don't know. Think he. I think he, for Baylor. He should be over at the spring game now. <laughs> he did play for Northwestern State. That one is deep to left field. Um, right after that went off of the bat, and she circles third and heads home to celebrate with her Sooner teammates. She's, she can throw it, but she has not established it. And she, when she can throw it, she leaves it flat a lot. All this debris. 80th home run of the season for the Sooners. The true Dari Orm we've seen in the past. Opposite field. That one is snared by Govan. Oklahoma native. Top of the second inning. Sooners up two to nothing. That ball hit on the screws, but Pylon is there and gets it over to Govan. Nobody on, two outs. Solo shot by Brito, started off the inning. Coleman lays it down and is safe. Pitch, pitch count wise or even. Oklahoma throwing 17 in the body <laughs> last night's outing. That one is hit right at Tovin, over to first. And we're out of the inning. In all of sport, let alone college sport. And it's because of plays like that. We look to see some of those in the postseason. Hot trying to get her timing down. Jennings to Sanders, two down. Heading the count, two and oh. Two outs here in the bottom of the second. On. West drives it and turns around Boone, who's able to track it down before the warning track. The Sooner fans saying, Boone, we head to the top of the third. A lot of clouds in the sky. 
as we're expecting storms tomorrow. Chopper or makes it look easy. Her so relaxed and just so confident. But she's definitely. That one pops the catcher's mitt, but too high. 67 miles per hour off the mark. I was single on a walk last night. Nugent skies that one. Hot stays right there. Two out. This game. So she did, did, was retired once. On and off the field. Getting it done. On the field here. Hits it right to West, who fires it over to Go Van. And out of the. Okay. Even, <laughs> even those silly ones right there. <laughs> even if they hurt. <laughs> yeah. Stream. Dribbles it to the left side. Burrito like a vacuum. Got her. <laughs> Afternoon. Lions snares the liner. Alyssa Wilson hits it right at Coleman, who makes no mistake and puts her away. In the bat. Went yard the last form from that stretch of hers in the circle. Brito bangs it right to the left side. West is there over to Govan. One down. Counts it. That one driven into right field, right center field, we should say. Wilson comes over. Coach from Arizona. We've got M Melissa. Coach Hop, thank you so much. For um, Sandra Day O'Connor High School, like we said, that was home of Grace Lyons and Jocelyn Erickson. Jocelyn not getting the start. This weather. <laughs> What's the weather like in Phoenix right now? Uh, really hot. <laughs> we Already. <laughs> All right, a fly ball. It's so fun. I would venture to say both of those were pretty talented high school players, too. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> to be recruited by Oklahoma. Shit <laughs> together? Um, with Grace, I won, and then. Um, Sorry, I was watching that pitch. <laughs> <laughs> it's it was, hard sometimes. Yeah, yeah. yeah, it was fantastic that last week. Um, 19th, I've been putting this bug in your ear. Like, <laughs> hey, they're playing again in April. Um, well, I actually have made it since COVID. Um, just kind of stepping out and taking the administrative role. I just haven't been been out there as much, but it's been quite a few years that yeah. we, we touched on it briefly earlier in the broadcast, just what a, a letter on her chest well. So that's the third out, coach. As, as a competitor that you play in conference. One and one to Tiari Jennings, who homered in her first at bat. That, that's the biggest thing to tell your pitching staff. Tiari Jennings back up the middle. Nice backhand by Pylon, but decides not to throw. Kind of going through, they, they focus on travel ball and they kind of blow off that high school. The time on a, on a team like this. Lee draws the walk, runners at first and second. Coach, how often do you? Just to be honest, is a lot of the club coaches get those phone calls. Um, Spikes that. Pylon showing off that range again. Guns are down. Runners move forward. It's pretty legit. I will tell you the first thing I did is I uh, sent my husband a pen. I'm hoping to, you know, give out some hugs and uh, definitely say hi for sure. Well, and Oklahoma's probably going to hit the road after this game with no it doesn't stand out. It's not like the Sydney Sanders that has the big hits. She's just consistent. Dribbles that one right at Govan. And that'll do it. Two runners left on. Oklahoma still... Like, what can I encourage them with how can I grow them apart from just enjoy this team I enjoy this coach I'm having fun doing it and it's just extra practice 
it's just another day you get to step on the field and get to work. This game has felt like all Oklahoma, but when you look at it. There's been six 0-0 zero -zero innings. West, the Go. bunt is made. Burrito dives for it, can't get it. Sliding into second base safely. Exciting so much play. happened right there. <laughs> a couple of head first slides on the same play. You don't see that every game. Ooh, that was such a clue. Now plotting as you can imagine and as you can hear. That one driven to right field. Got up there in a hurry, but coming over as Hodge to put it away. That one, nice play made over there by Jennings and gets it to Sanders. Soon, Oklahoma up 2 nothing. Just incredible numbers she puts up herself. Brito drives that one deep to left center field. Wilson at the wall on the warning track, squeezes it. Inside for Orm and strikes her out. Dari Orm is now pieced together three straight. And struggles the first two innings, but just has been on fire the last couple innings. Sounds like life, right, Kelly? Some <laughs> didn't like it. <laughs> Boone, chopper. Orm fields it, flips it over to Govan, and Baylor's out of the inning. Top of the lineup come. Yeah, absolutely. I mean, just number of wins, starts to the season, just. Uh... Hits it right to Sanders, who steps on first, one down. And popped up to shortstop. Brito is there, double clutches, and guns are down. Govan hitting 390, huge February 19 point for Baylor. But swings through that one, struck her out. May out of the inning and continues to roll. Tournament. Not many conferences that back and just gives one more opportunity to see some great teams. Smooth play by Tohu. Your, your, your team, and that's your school, and just that pride. Wow. Almost an incredible play deep in the hole. Anything, I think, that just builds some encouragement in your shortstop. Just, hey, I believe in you, and that's an incredible effort. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to in your hometown, close to it. Only one strikeout on the day, but just doing well. Holding these Oklahoma hitters. Tovin tries to do it again with the backhand. <laughs> Back up the middle by Hodge. Lilio is tagged out by <laughs> Pylon. Sun poking through the clouds and Sidney Sanders back to first base. That one hit squarely to shortstop. Tobin Fields over to Govan. Well, that used to be, um, they used to play midweek matchups. So, like, when I played at Baylor, well, you played Texas, you played A&M, you played Oklahoma maybe two weeks ago, three weeks ago, and then they're coming back now this Wednesday. A home and home to Lubbock. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> that just sounds tough. Two up. It's like, uh, I was just checking to see if Oklahoma and Oklahoma State did the same thing. but The number one ranked Sooners looking for 34 straight. Ball four. <laughs> the sophomore who has just about done everything this weekend. Five. Runner on first is hot. Popped up. Coming in to make the play is Coleman. And that'll do it. And just what Oklahoma does, just playing their game, incredible defense, great pitching outings from the circle, and that offensive production.
Um, but like Maybe even after that, but for right now, they have dropped three straight to the Sooners. Well, for Kelly Levesque and our